no. your, 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 when your, you your file, claims. When you file an, an, an unemployment claim, uh, your employer uh, can to. contest it. Yes, has so, to agree to so, it. Yeah, yeah, they have to agree to it and they can contest it. Mm -hmm. So, so what, contesting what, meaning? Contesting lying. meaning, so, so if you're laid off, you're eligible for unemployment. Yeah. But if you left voluntarily uh, or if you got fired for something that you did so you meet a tabitha you, 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 you meet a tabitha uh, long time always viewed this thing of career coaching as a gimmick yes i'm saying it you know, you know like the way you have you know like um life coaches yes. nowadays you know they yes, have coaches yes. for everything yes yes so there was a point in my life when i used to view those um career coaches mm. as as gimmicks but over time uh as i've been listening to to tabitha and jerry and tabitha and jerry is, is is one of the best you know like when it comes to that you know she's been giving out a lot of free content uh and and i think my eureka moment you mm -hmm. know like came with her you know when i kept listening to her and i'm like okay Okay, this makes sense. You know, initially, you know, like when she started, because I've known Tabitha for a very long time, but when she started going public about, you know, like what she does and the coaching mm -hmm. and all that, yeah, I was like, okay, yeah, this are, and, the, and initially was, yeah, these are good talking points, but at some point, you know, like now things just started, you know, like flashing in my mind, like this is exactly what I've been going through at work, you know, like you're working hard, you're working hard, but you're not the one who gets tapped the credit on the shoulder yes, correct, you know like yes. to get to get um, a promotion and i think preparing as part of a preparation for a layoff because you don't start preparing for a layoff when it happens you start have you start preparing when things are okay this is an emergency plan it's like uh it's like the fire truck the fire truck just doesn't show up you know like when the fire starts they're doing drills you know like when there's no fire so to me having a career coach is kind of like having that drill so that when that fire comes and that layoff comes you have your resume ready you have your linkedin ready uh and you have you know like all the interviewing skills you need to have when you're going into an interview ready such that when it happens it's just about moving from here to the interview and within record time you're somewhere else we'll check it back to you all right yeah it's uh, important so who was i all right so i'm saying layoff. so the layoff has not, it has happened. So hopefully, uh, you've been talking to Ali about your finances and you've been, you know, putting the, you know, the maximum allowed in your 401k or HSA um, and your IRA. So now your finances are set. Uh, the next thing is, do you have an emergency fund? So mm. ideally, you want three to six months because that's going to show you whether you you know, you get your uh, severance uh, package or if you are going to be depending on unemployment, which we know unemployment only is going to give you what? a certain percentage of your income. I have a story for unemployment in the layer. <laughs> it's not um, guaranteed. Let me just put it that way. Oh, it's yeah. not guaranteed. <laughs> yeah, it's, yeah, it's, yeah. yeah it's, I have a story unemployment, about that too. Yeah, unemployment is not guaranteed. Then the next thing is hopefully you've been operating from a budget or it's, it's time to start one. So you sit down and you look at your expenditure and you, you know, you divide your, your basic, your necessity. So whether it's your mortgage, your rent, your utilities, and then you are discretionary. So if you eating out, if you like Starbucks, then it, you might have to start taking cuts or maybe if you have so many streaming services, maybe you, you have to decide you only have one you know, disconnect cable and just have a bare minimum. I mean, even if you're unemployed, you, you may still need some entertainment, but, it's, you know, you just need the bare minimum. So you're not hemorrhaging money. You know, you're now on a fixed budget. We you don't know when you're next going to get a job <laughs> to, and you're, you're, you are, yeah, that's my assistant. <laughs> no, no. Yeah, we like your assistant. <laughs> that you that your assistant. Hi, can, assistant. She, assistant can really work. Yeah. Hi, assistant. Uh, I, <laughs> I, I, I love your assistant. Eh? I love your assistant. <laughs> uh, so the, I think budget, like I know a lot of us, if you ask them how much, what is your budget amount, they, we would not even be able to say. 
you know, so I think that's one of the exercises I started doing about, you know, five years ago is just sitting down and knowing this is, I must have this. This is just my basics. So, you know, mortgage, utilities, and food. Ile ya kahawa and going out to eat, you know, that's not a necessity and does not necessarily have to be on my budget. Mm-hmm. And that really helped me when uh, coming up with a plan for my emergency fund because it will be key. That's what will help you. Because even when you apply for unemployment, like uh, Omos said, it's not a guarantee you're going to get it. And also, it doesn't come right away. There's, there could be a, a gap before you start getting it and your right. paycheck or stuff. How are you going to survive? Yeah, and, and on that unemployment note, you know, Tabitha here is saying my second job in HR when I was 24 was contesting unemployment claims. Now, I personally have an experience where I met a Tabitha. So you see, the thing is when I was young, uh, I was very nonchalant about so wait, certain wait, things. Wait, 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 yeah? wait. You're trying to tell us that uh, a, a, a contestant. Con, a, a, yes, a, a so, so, this, so this is what happens. So a time when, there when is you a file, person who's, who's mother than now, hearing your, compla- now, your, your, when you your file, claims. When you file an, an, an unemployment claim, uh, your employer uh, can contest to. it. Yes, has so, to agree to so, it. Yeah, yeah, they have to agree to it and they can contest it. Mm-hmm. So, so what, contesting what, meaning... Contesting lying. meaning... So, so if you're laid off, you're eligible for unemployment. Yeah. But if you left voluntarily, uh. or if you got fired for something that you did, so you meet a Tabitha. You you, you, you meet a Tabitha. Uh. So what happened? So Tabitha's a contester. Yeah. So what happened in a certain <laughs> job? And this was very stupid. Uh World Cup was coming up. <laughs> Which one? This was very stupid. Apana, no, this was 2006. This was Kitambo. More than a Jesu. World Cup was coming up. So, uh. so I had calculated. You know, like there was no way, and at that time, that that World Cup was, I believe, it was in Germany, that the 2006 World Cup, it was in Germany, and uh, yeah, because the 2002 was in Korea, was yeah. in South Korea, Japan, yeah. somewhere. And you know, I, I think I, it you was, know yeah. that 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 was my, uh, it was my first World Cup in the US, and I needed focus. You know, this is the World Cup. <laughs> I needed focus. I did not need distractions. Eh. Like a job. <laughs> eh. Yeah. Jesus so what I did. So 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 I did some calculations. I did some calculations. I knew about unemployment. Is that right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So I had done some calculations. Uh-huh. And yeah. And I yeah, I just, you know, like uh, abruptly quit a job. Uh-huh. And I knew that I was gonna apply for Unemployment. I was gonna apply for unemployment, mm-hmm. and uh, and I was gonna get paid. So I went. I did apply for unemployment, and guess what? You, you know, met a Tabitha. The, no, the first check oh, came sorry. in. The first check came in. The second check came in. When the <laughs> third one was coming, because those days there was not even direct deposit. It was an actual check that you're getting. Now the third one, I got a letter that, oh, it's due, you know, like I wasn't even understanding the letter. You know, so I was told that I have to participate in this event. So there was a 1-800 number I called. And then they told me, your employer is contesting this. And I was like, why are they contesting it? I'm not working right now. I can prove to you I'm not working. I was like, no, they are contesting, you know, because there's this, this, this and reason. Yeah. So I actually went to, it was in, uh, for those who are familiar with the area, it was in, the office was in Wheaton. Yes. It was in Wheaton. It seems yep. you've been there too. Wait, wait, but uh, Muta <laughs> still there. <laughs> yeah, so... So Mimi, I was like, I so me, I thought it was just a routine thing. We are going there, and uh, and this thing is resolved, and they're giving me back my money. Apana. Yeah, so it's I went a there. It's meet and greet, and that chapter yeah. of HR is there yeah. saying, and I Z. could turn out with HR, and no, Omeni Gyoka. No, no, 